It's time for our first award. I am so honored, Al Pacino. It's really good to see you here. Uh, this is uh, an experience for me. He's like, I never played a video game in my entire life. Yeah, he's trying to make out that teleprompter, but, uh, poor guy. It's hard for me to see the teleprompter. I don't play a whole lot of video games. <laughs> Winner. Got to be Christopher Judge, right? Christopher yeah. Judge. Yeah. Which, yeah, his performance in that is really good. I mean, he's the best, right? Yeah. We all know he's the best. You are heroes because you got so many people in the world through a very- That feels like it was a bit cued, though. Here we go. Hades 2. Oh, it's not Hades 2, no, right? It's no, it's It definitely sounds like Hades. It does. Hades DLC? Please tell me that I'll start with a world premiere of DLC. Yeah. All right, yeah, Hades 2, interesting. Didn't that look fantastic? I'm looking forward to watching Lawrence stream this. <laughs> I like watercolor a lot. Okay, so this is like a commercial break. We that shouldn't take segment, shots for right? commercial breaks, though. Because they, they're going to do a bunch of fucking commercial breaks. But there's no reason. Why do you have commercial breaks for the commercials? I'll do a shot with you. Yeah, I'll do a shot with you. <sighs> if you want to do a shot, Lawrence, I'm in. Stray is fantastic. What a fantastic video game, yeah. I teared up absolutely at the end. Shit. Stray is, a, is a, one of the few video games that made me feel something. When we think... So I originally... Wait, did it say world premiere? It did. Yes! What is so it? So my original shot rule was a world premiere for a new season of a games of service game. Is this Destiny? Yeah. That's a shot. That's a shot, That's baby. a shot, absolutely. Please tell me how I can buy Last of Us again. I would love to send them $80 or whatever the fuck <laughs> it costs to, to pay for another video game. <gasps> Look at all those quotes, though. Please tell me, give me, I, I want to send them more money for Last of Us a thousand times. Oh, it's got a release date. Ah! I can't roll my eyes enough at this shit. You don't like Last of Us part one, part I? I've played it and it's fine. So wait, why should I move the camera to the bottom right? People keep saying that you're covering like the names and the winners. Oh, that's true, I am. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. Two seaters! I can't wait. Ah. A Wampa! It's like episode two all over again. <laughs> he had two in the first one, Lawrence. Did he? Oh, he did. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. That's, that, uh, that's his new lightsaber. It's got a hilt. I, that's what I always liked about Kylo Ren's saber is. It was like a medieval bastard sword. That was pretty dope. May the force be with you. Hi, Cameron. Hi, Cameron. I used Grubhub to order food to get the pizza emote in Final Fantasy XIV. Nice. Good job, Lawrence. It was a good emote. Officially a gamer. The food wasn't the best. No, they wouldn't. I don't think they put hands. I don't think they put Kojima in the middle, would they? Kojima. No. What? No, they put Kojima at the end. Well, that looks like Kojima. It's got the it's got the lines. Powered by Decima with support from Gorilla. <laughs> Death Stranding Two, Bruce. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> no, come on. Ah, there's a baby. <laughs> Kojima loves babies. This Go. game is the embodiment of over overrated and pretentious. Death Stranding is pretentious. By a lot. But I don't That's know right. that overrated necessarily counts. There's a lot of games that are way more overrated than Death Stranding. Oh, Fire Shark Infinite. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Zingdom. Oh, come on, a unicycle is the most lame instrument. How you're He's old! <laughs> I love the way Japanese developers age up their protagonists. It's always all gray. Yeah, but still like jacked as fuck. Yeah. This is like 20 years on or 30 years on from Death Stranding. <laughs> all right, take a shot. Let's take a shot. Let's take a shot. <laughs> we all knew he'd be there. Man, he's on stage. This was a guaranteed shot. So wait, this was the thing that was supposedly going to be a VR game? Let me see those kicks, Hideo. Show me those shoes. Oh, those are cool! Ask Love those shoes. With us here, uh, hello, Leia. What's the... Great to have you guys with us here. There's like a relief um, in his Troy velvet here as jacket. Well. We heard him to... there. Hello, here. Troy. Uh, hey, Kojima. We're so excited. There he is, Troy. Troy. Collaboration you have with uh, an amazing cast. Uh, I wanted to ask. I adored Death Stranding. I don't give a f I, like. I didn't give two shits about Death Stranding, but I love that he's still doing it. I must soar the realms of sky. Are I you, can be one of those. Are you things. gonna do it? Put on your VR headset. How do I do it? Tell I don't know. Out. Put on your VR headset. And do the thing. I want to take off all my clothes in real life, pee on myself, and be a bird. <laughs> <laughs> so if I just go to PUBG Mobile, Play Store, a free vehicle wrap, I punch in sky. Through the end of You're missing the Players PUBG Wendy's PUBG Mobile Game Awards other ad integration. I love seeking my progress. <laughs> Seamlessly across the bike. Seamlessly. Ugh, I hate seeking my progress and finding seams. 
<laughs> Everyone's gonna play the shit out of this game, even though they're all shitting on it. Like, it's fashionable. Yeah, it's it's fashionable to shit on anything Blizzard or Activision, but they're gonna play the fuck out of it. Fuck yeah, they will. All right, this is sick. I mean, again, these cinematics are not the game. Oh well, sure, cares. And I, that's not my thing. I've long been a believer that gamers are mad until there's a dope trailer. I mean, Blizzard, are... Blizzard has always been really good about making really good trailers. Always. Okay. There you go. June 6. Here are the nominees for most anticipated game. Uh, Starfield. Can you imagine a most no, anticipated game? No, 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 I'm sorry. Legend of, of Zelda. Legend of Zelda. No, no, Zelda. Zelda. Hogwarts it's gotta be Zelda. It's Zelda. Yeah, it's, uh, it's Zelda all the way. Or Hogwarts. Hogwarts is Starfield. super anticipated, but uh, Zelda, Based Zelda wins. Based purely on, like, Zelda, demographic appeal. It's gotta be Zelda. Yeah, it's Zelda. There's no way it's Maybe not Zelda. Maybe a fan favorite, but and the game award goes to... The Legend of Zelda <laughs> Tears of the Kingdom. Now it's time for another world premiere. He said it. He said it. Ugh. Aloy's back. In the VR version of whatever. Aloy 3. This is the James Cameron's Avatar video game. Fuck me. I didn't play enough of uh, Forbidden West. Me neither. I played like four, uh, six hours, seven hours of it. I enjoyed it. I didn't even get that far. All right. I got to piss. What is this? This feels so much like Battlefield, but there's no way it's Battlefield. There it is. Yep. Whatever. Wait, why did they play that sound? Oh, because somebody went through the pipe. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay, so these bricks are just floating here. Uh, just popping this pipe. He sounds Italian. How many writers do you think put their heads together to decide what the first pipe sequence was? Pretty smart production from Jeff to have Animal running after that shit. Get the energy back up. Huh? Well, because, yeah, because people are, he knows people are upset about Chris Pratt. Got to for Ragnarok. Yeah. They have a lot of really good. Uh, they really do. Yeah, a lot of really good accessibility options. That's fair. This is a race that. No matter who wins, the player is the real winner. Absolutely so true. Out there and make totally true. Yep. It's Thank becoming you. more and more acceptable to be like, I'm gonna play this game on easy. Yeah. And okay. then like, just have fun. By the way, uh, we're at two and a half hours now. Uh, uh, from the start of the actual show. We're at three hours from the pre-show. Here are the nominees for the best game direction. This is big time fucked as a category. Cause it implies that you understand the like inner departmental complexities of game direction. What the fuck is this award and what is it for? You're just saying it was a good game. You have no idea what his directing style so, is. So Lawrence is discovering what the Oscars do every year. <laughs> uh, the Oscars every year, they go best director yeah. and they go yeah, best picture, best picture, yeah. right? And everyone goes, how come the best director didn't win the best picture? It's this invitation to think that art is objective. And, and it's not. It's not. It's not, yeah. It's an entirely it's all human subjective, creation. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. It's a human institution. That's right. And then somehow, we as humans... Well, we want, we want to make everything objective. We do. But it's not... We just can't. What is this shit? People are saying Armored Core over and over. Yeah, people want that from From Software. Because it's the one franchise from From Software that... Is not good? I mean, like... People, people say Armored Core to vote themselves as being like... Uh, I mean, it actually might be Armored Core. It looks it like actually, it. Actually, it's Super yeah. Armored Core. It totally looks Fuck. like it. Yeah, yeah, It's yeah. Armored Core. Oh! <laughs> it's Armored Core! <laughs> no! <laughs> Shit! If people that play Elden Ring play Armored Core, that's right, this that's is right. going to be a problem. That's right, you're right. Y'all don't understand. Game We're looking at uh, three so and a half hours with the pre-show. After Elden Ring. So, hold on a minute. Whoa. Fuck! <laughs> after, after Elden Ring. Elden Ring. This place where Bandai Namco put out a press release saying the world of Elden Ring will continue with more games. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. And they had to retract it because From Software was like, no, the fuck it's not. <laughs> yeah. They announced another Armored Core. I mean, that's dope, but also weird. I mean, like, I just hope they actually. So in my opinion, Elden Ring was a an improvement on what they did with Dark Souls and Bloodborne and Sekiro. Perhaps now it's time to segue into the Inside Games after show. Is it really? Wait, hold on. We haven't gotten to the game of the year. Haven't we? No. Oh, I thought the game, I thought the show was over. My <laughs> no, bad. the show is not over. Oh, goodness. My segue is. Wait, game of the different. year has not been announced yet. Woof. Okay, well. Wait, has game of the year been, been announced? The answer is no. Got a freet. We're going to have like Metal Gear Solid 4 style summon fights. We're going to have loading doors. It sounds like Final Fantasy XII dialogue. Which is to say, hyper compressed, <laughs> like big time compressed. Are you excited? 
I mean, I'm excited. June. Wow. Okay. I'm excited. <laughs> I trust the production. Okay. All right. All that right. trailer did not show me anything particularly Please that blew me up. Sure. Sure. All right. What's your uh, prediction? Game of the year. Elden Ring. I, I agree. I think I think Elden Ring. God of War takes all the other awards, and Elden Ring takes yeah, this one. Yeah, yeah. I, I, that's what I think. Yeah, but I could be wrong. Elden Ring, if not Sony bias in the voting. <laughs> that's it. That's it. That's all wow, it's Lawrence, be. Lawrence, corruption huh. in the Game Awards voting. Not necessarily corruption. All right, not necessarily. Cor Let me put it this way: When I graduated, when I when I soared above, and I joined the ranks of gaming media elite, I realized, <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is just a bunch of people who did not have to work when they were fucking 14. That's really it. And so, you know, I'm just saying. The gaming elite, they're going to vote for it. We should hold hands. Bruce, All right, let's hold hands. We're holding hands. Here we go. Lawrence the, and I have never hold hands before. We've never done this before. Never once. This is it. Lawrence. Game of the year 2022. Are we taking a shot for anything? Does no. Jeff get to announce this? All right, here we go. This is it. All right. Game of the year winner is Elden Ring. I knew it. That music is so good. It's really good. Bad news, guys. This was this was a three and a half hour show, starting with the pre-show. Yes, that's right. Yeah, it was. It absolutely was. Yeah. Elden Ring two. We don't need it. We actually don't need it. It's true. Just leave it behind. No, yeah. But they're gonna make it, but we don't need it. Um, thank you so much. Thank you. Very good. Hey, Martin. You know, real quick, I want to thank everybody and say that I think I want to nominate this Wait, award that? to uh, my reformed Orthodox rabbi, Bill Clinton. Thank you, everybody. Eh? What? Bill Clinton? Bill Clinton. What the fuck? Who is that? Oh, right. he fell out of somebody's well, pocket. The vet police, what? congratulations. Who it's been such a special night, and I can't believe. What was that? <laughs> hey. Bye, you, Jeff. Bye, Jeff. Thank, thank you, you Jeff. Here's that guy in the jacket again. We love you, Jeff. Bill Clinton. I heard him say Bill Clinton. Yeah, that's all I got. That's, that's all I got. What was, what the fuck was that? This award, thank everybody. Hey, Martin. You know, real quick, I want to thank everybody and say that I think I want to nominate this award to uh, my Reformed Orthodox Rabbi Bill Clinton. Thank you, everybody. What are you saying? I'm Reformed Orthodox Rabbi, Rabbi Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton. What the fuck? Where did he come from? Who is that person? Okay, well, that doesn't make any sense. I don't know, Bruce. I think we got Illuminati. <laughs> We got Illuminati. We got trolled up. Yeah, what wow. was that all about? Right. Oh, it's trending now. What do you think, Bruce? The Game Awards 2022. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that? Uh, they were exactly what I expected. Yeah. They were not shorter. They were not anything at all. They were exactly what I expected. And that's not a bad thing. Uh, Jeff always puts on a good show. Lots of world premieres. Nothing yeah. Nothing really surprised me. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I don't know. What, what about you? Yeah, about right. Yeah, yeah. that's about right. Yeah. There wasn't wasn't any showstoppers really. I mean, uh, what is it? Death Stranding Two, I think might be the big shit. Were you really surprised by that? We I'm all knew we were gonna get Death Stranding Two. Did we? I absolutely knew. Yeah. What? The Hades Two, interesting. If you want to talk Hades, about that, Hades Two is was exciting. That was something I don't think anybody expected at all. Um, and I'm kind of excited. Like I I played Hades for five six hours, enjoyed it, didn't beat it. But really liked it and uh, really surprised that Hades 2 was announced. People are saying that uh, the Bill Clinton kid was arrested. Like already? I mean, click the link. Oh, hold on. We got to we Click tweet. the link. The individual ah. who interrupted our Game of the Year moment has been arrested. Where did he come from? Right on. How did he make it up there with the group of people? That's the beauty of the live show. And then talk about Bill Clinton and then get arrested. Yeah, the fact that it was like adjacent to some, some Jewish business, I was like... This is bad. This is bad, and it should get airtime. But what you gonna do? It's all live. I just want to know where did this attack come from? So good news, Bill Clinton kid is arrested. All right, no problem. Fair enough. Hades two, 
Armored Armor Core two. Six. Armor Core Six. Death Stranding Two. Death Stranding which Two, which Lawrence was very excited about. Yes. Yeah. All right. Should we wrap it up, Bruce? Let's do it. Let's wrap it up. The Game Awards is so big now that people are infiltrating it and saying things. Jeff just wanted to share some video games with everyone. Game releases. <laughs> some some twerp had to skew it all. Hey, thanks for watching, everyone. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching, everybody. <laughs>